I'm really excited for this build. We got the two most important parts, the boat and the motor. What's up guys, it's Life Offshore. Today I want you to follow along as I built this Talon F20. Enjoy the video, like, comment, and subscribe. So we're on the way now to Fort Myers to pick up the outboard. It's a 300 Pro, uh, 20 inch shaft. I got the utility trailer back there. Uh, hopefully it makes it. I'm not too positive it will. Uh, so I'll keep you guys posted. Uh, it's about a two and a half hour drive from uh, Miami. So we're almost there though. Making some surf and turf. We just got back from Fort Myers. Here's a video of, of the actual motor. We were able to make it back. It was about a 250 mile round trip. The trailer did better than I expected. All good. A Mercury 300 Pro, 20 inch shaft. Got some stuff we're gonna do to it. I'm really excited for this build. We got the two most important parts, the boat and the motor. So now we just gotta get all the electronics, speakers, uh, GPS, basically everything, you know, I got nothing, nothing for this boat besides that. So everything else I gotta buy now. We're gonna have, we're gonna have MTM rig the whole boat. So if you guys don't know them, Miami Total Marine, they're gonna be taking care of this boat uh, top to bottom. We're gonna drop off the boat uh, sometime in the new year, maybe January 2nd, January 3rd. What's up guys? Just ran a lot of errands today. I picked up most of the electronics that I needed and the accessories that I needed for the boat. So let me start off with the speakers, the sound system. I'm going very simple on this boat, nothing too crazy. I'm starting off with the 7.7 .7 Signature Series by Fusion. I got a JL lamp. I got two Lumatex, they're gonna be like my courtesy lights on the boat. Uh, my two bilge pumps, my battery charger. I got Atwood flush cleats. These things are awesome. I got four of them. I'm doing a nine inch Garmin. This is gonna be my steering wheel. Really nice, and under here I got aluminum billet, battery boxes for my jack plate. I got a four and a half inch STR. It's manual, not hydraulic, is what I wanted. So far it's looking good. Obviously still work in progress. If you don't know the end game of the boat, it's just gonna look like a bunch of pieces just all scattered around, but I know that it's almost done because just a couple components and the boat will literally look like it's done. Let's hope for the best, let's make sure everything's good. I still have to do the seat deck on the boat and I gotta do the upholstery as well. So, little things left, but she's almost done. So I ended up picking up the boat last night. It was too dark for me to film, but here I am, it's early in the morning. We're at Salt Works, so everyone's gonna be in charge of all the floor and the decking. It's gonna be custom, gonna be very nice, but I was pleased with how the boat came out, guys. Let me show you a little walk around. Um, upholstery is getting done right now. He's basically mapping it all out right there with that. So that basically shoots the signal back to the machine and the machine digitizes it. As Kevin from Saltworks is finishing up, what he ended up doing was basically bringing the floor of the boat onto a computer. So that's what his machine allows him to do. Then he's able to design whatever design you want and then cut it with this machine. This machine cuts precisely to exactly the design you want that's drawn up on the computer. You guys have to hit Kevin up. He's the best in the business at this. I'm gonna give you the phone number, you call him. Uh, not only is he the best, but he has the best prices. You cannot compete with his prices and the quality is top notch. Here you can see that this is the process where he starts sticking the seed deck onto the floor of the boat. All right guys, check this out. Finally got the lower unit back from Bob's after like a month and a half, almost two months. And check out this beauty. It's hard to see here, but I'm gonna show you guys right now. I'm taking it to the shop right now to have it installed. Good 
morning, guys. I'm super excited. The day has finally come where the boat is finished. Everything has been done. Um, the long process that I've had to build this boat, to have everything, to get all the parts, everything needed to make it functional. It's finally being trailered by the truck right now. We're going to Matheson Hammocks. I'm gonna splash the boat there, show you guys a few test rides, uh, make a couple passes. We'll see what I end up doing or where I end up going, but I'm, I'm super excited. I can't wait to show you guys right now. I'm gonna try to find some empty parking lot or maybe if the marina's empty enough, I can show you the boat there. We're out on the water. It's a little windy, you probably won't be able to hear me, but I'm gonna shoot some nice clips now. <laughs> 